Welcome to the Los Flamingos Golf Resort, the ultimate paradise for golf lovers. Only a short drive to Porta Manus and Marbella Center. Benavis just around the corner with its beautiful restaurants. I can't wait to show you around. Welcome, guys. Right now, I'm standing right in the heart of the Los Flamengos Resort, and I'm surrounded by three stunning golf courses. And behind me is the Anantara five-star Villa Padiena Palace Hotel. And inside is the world-famous Anantara Spa. And also, not to forget to mention, some absolutely stunning restaurants, which I can't wait to show you around. So come on, let's go have a quick look. So here we are in the heart again of the Los Flamingos Resort. But I want to tell you a little bit about our Marbella and our Los Flamingos and what makes it just so, so special. Well, you know Marbella, 320 days of sunshine a year and Los Flamingos. Inside this resort alone, you've got your own spa center right here in the hotel. You've got restaurants and bars surrounding you and Sandy Shore is just a couple of minutes drive away. It's the perfect, perfect place to set up your new holiday home here in Marbella. Now the quality of the property and the modern cool sleek design is why this area amongst some others are getting known to be on the new Golden Mile and that's stretching all the way from Marbella to Estepona. So I want to do another thing here now is I want to take you for a little drive and show you around this stunning resort. Come along with me. <laughs> So arriving at the resort, you're immediately greeted by this 24-hour uh, gated community. The properties themselves are actually set up on the hills, giving you kind of that south orientation and views right across Africa and Gibraltar, of course, giving you sun practically all day. The resort's beautifully set with trees going right through the whole of the resort, just giving that really wonderful feel as you drive through here. Well, we've just arrived at the Acosta development and Acosta is one of my favorites and I'm gonna tell you why. Well, first, it's got 105 apartments, so it's not a huge development. Two swimming pools, two paddle courts, but what I really, really, really love about this is it's on top of the world. You're standing right on top of the whole resort and the views are just spectacular. Gulf, sea, you've got the views of Africa, incredible, incredible views. And would you believe that a luxury apartment here is only starting from 340,000 and going up as much as only 750,000? Incredible. So come on, let's go and have a look from the terrace and I'm gonna show you a little bit more about this wonderful resort of Los Flamingos from the Acosta Terrace. And as I mentioned before, we've got three golf courses. Right over here, this golf course that you can see, well, that's the Flamingos Golf. Over here, you've got the Al Afrini Golf Course. And right behind us is another golf course, the Tomoras Golf Course. And not to forget to mention the Michael Campbell's Golf Academy, which is uh, something quite special. And I'm sure many of you have heard of it if you're a golfer. So right here, again, I'm in Los Flamengos, and this time I'm in Oya 19. Oya 19 means hole 19, and why wouldn't it? We're in the beautiful Los Flamengos with the three golf courses. So here you've got your own little pitch and putt. The uh, development itself has about 139 apartments, and prices are starting from around 400 all the way up to 700. The development has three swimming pools, it's got its own tennis court, children's playground, and really, really important, the views are just outstanding. So right now I'm standing on the Alfrini, pronunciation's not my thing, golf course, and actually from here you can see some of our, uh, some of our developments, or some of the developments that we work with. 
So you've got there, that's where we were actually before on the terrace, that's the Acosta development. And then underneath it, T5. So T5's got about 39 um, apartments. Apartments are starting from around 370,000 all the way up to actually uh, 980,000. And that's Oya 19 just over there. Now I don't think anybody needs to guess where I am right now. Of course, I'm at T6, Los Flamingos. So T6 consists of 54 luxurious apartments with beautiful golf and sea views. The development itself also has its own buggy uh, parking space with every one of the apartments. And apartments are starting from around, um, well, about 550 all the way up to 980. Sorry for the noise, but that's the gardener cutting the grass of your new home here in Spain. And welcome to Royal Flamingos. Now Royal Flamingos is more of a traditional Andalusian style or Moorish style coloring. And actually one of my favorite resorts. I love, love, love the way these apartments are done and the gardens are just so tropical. There's about 105 apartments and apartments actually, funny enough, are only starting from around 370, but they do go all the way up to 980. There's three swimming pools, tennis courts and tropical, tropical gardens. All the grass is just trimmed beautifully. Welcome to Spain. Welcome to Royal Flamingos. Well, welcome to Alanda Flamingos. Alanda. Alanda, it sounds, you know, to me it sounds kind of Irish. Ah, Jesus, Alanda. Anyway, so, this development consists of 60 apartments. Apartments are starting from around 400,000 and all the way up to 950,000. Two pools, modern sleek design and mature gardens. So welcome to Alanda Flamingos. So welcome to Mirador de los Flamingos. And Mirador meaning, by the way, the view. And why is that? Panoramic sea views again, and golf, and God knows what else. Beautiful. So properties here are starting from around 400,000 all the way up to only 600,000. You can see it's kind of a more traditional design, which in my heart, tradition is great, so I love it. And uh, yeah, I mean, it's got mature gardens and it's a great place to buy, to live. Welcome to Mirador. As a residential area, Los Flamingos is mainly uh, set with uh, private villas and apartments, all set in these wonderful uh, lush gardens with great views, again, across the sea and the golf courses, really making this very, very, very private, but yet an incredible location to live or to come on holiday. It's restaurants La Pergola, 99 Sushi Bar and Restaurant, the nearby Beach Club, and also the sophisticated Eddie's Bar are all firm favorites with Los Flamingos. And if you ever want to leave this exclusive resort, the beaches are just five minutes away. The foothills of Serranía de Ronde is close by, as well as the small town of San Pedro de Alcantara, which offers a wide range of shops, restaurants, cafes, schools, sports facilities, and leisure facilities within an easy reach. Greenery is all around in the form of the Flamingos, Alfarini and Tromore, golf courses of the Los Flamingos and the Michael Campbell Golf Academy. The only one of its kind that specializes in the short game and the personalized courses. There doesn't seem to be an angle in this beautiful resort without a view. In fact, over there is Hole 55, one of the Villa Pidiena Palace Hotel's beautiful restaurants. Now, Costa del Sol is quickly getting adapted to being Europe's number one golf destination, with over, I think it's 22 golf courses. In fact, three of them right here, surrounded in this area. A fantastic, fantastic location for you golf lovers. And if you don't love golf, well, you're definitely going to love these incredible views. Wow. No wonder they call it Villa Pediena Palace. It is a palace. Incredible. Look at this lobby. Wow. Well, okay, so I'm going to take you over to the spa. Unfortunately, I already tried to get in, but they said in the suit, it's not happening and I haven't got slippers. But my gosh, it's such a great spa. So come, I'll show you 
couple of snippets of the inside of this wonderful spa. As a residential area, Los Flamingos is dominated by private villas and a selection of attractive apartments all set on spacious gardens. The views across the golf courses and the lake and the sea all form a big part of the appeal, along with the beautiful, peaceful setting and the proximity to the surrounding services of Marbella and Estepona. There is a good choice of existing villas dating back to a maximum of about 20 years, meaning that any home for sale in Los Flamingos will be relatively new and therefore high spec. The real estate market of Los Flamengos lies within the mid to high end segment, starting from two bedroom apartments and panoramic penthouses to small villas all the way up to expansive mansions. The typical Los Flamengos property would range from a spacious apartment or a penthouse in a quality gated community to a medium to large villa in a peaceful leafy area. Increasingly, both tend to be modern, as Los Flamingos is one of the areas of the Costa del Sol with an excellent choice of newly built homes. With even the oldest homes in Los Flamingos being little more than 20 years old and featuring an adaptation of the classic Mediterranean architecture. This is a residential zone with an emphasis on contemporary style and amenities. The apartments and the villas feature the latest technology, design, build, qualities, and of course the amenities. Sadly, we're coming to the end of this tour, but before I go, I want to ask you a quick favor. Check out down in the description where you can find out more information about all of these wonderful developments within this community of Los Flamencos. Now, Sadly, it's time to go. And on behalf of myself and Engel and Volkers, I'd like to thank you for joining us today. And I want you to know, we're your reliable agents here on the Costa del Sol with five offices, both if you're looking to sell, if you're looking to buy, or you're looking to rent, we're here for you. So I look forward to seeing you very, very soon. Goodbye.